Uh, the idea for We Remember Rings came about um, as a result of just meeting uh, different people throughout my daily travels. And uh, what I began to notice was that there was a, a continuity of people feeling very, very proud to go to the school. And uh, they also talked about the, the high standards, the academic standards that unfortunately were not um, the usual experiences of, of most people in, our, in the community. And then uh, fast forward, we began to start hearing um, you know, troubles about what was going on uh, with our inner city schools uh, as it related to the FCAT. You begin to read the comments that people would leave uh, saying, you know, hey, the school uh, needs to be closed down. Uh, it, it's not working anymore. That community, uh, you know, it uh, doesn't deserve uh, the educational dollars. And um, I begin to, of course, out of uh, some frustration, begin to say, hey, what can I do to uh, let people know that this school uh, that they are talking about and indeed the community back in the day were um, the pride of that community and in fact were the pride uh, of, of uh, Jacksonville. Rings is an important part of the community because it is more than just a high school. This was for all practical purposes a public school that was set up as a private school and uh, Dr. Robinson's leadership was so uh, phenomenal that he wanted these students to be ready to uh, be able to go into any aspect of, uh, of the uh, work world, career world, and to be the leaders of that world. And you know, you have to uh, understand that we're talking about the, the, the middle 60s uh, before the doors really had opened as they began to uh, leave Reigns and go out into the work world, they all uh, carried with them this veneer of, uh, of, of, of astuteness, of polishedness, uh, of just a full command of whatever it is that they were doing because they were told that you are representing us. You know, the one thing that every uh, Reigns graduate can tell you is that when they went out into the world, whether it was in, in college or in, in their career world, people would always ask them, uh, where were you from? And they would say, Jacksonville. And they would say, well, where did you go to high school? And they'd say, I went to William and Rings. And that was the tradition uh, that, that Dr. Robinson laid down of, of high excellence, uh, whether it be uh, in the classroom, uh, you know, on the uh, sports uh, arena, anywhere you were going to have a high level of excellence. That has kind of declined, but we believe that through remembering, and that's why we call the, the documentary, We Remember Rains. And by remembering all of those great traditions, remembering the, the excellence, uh, we can pass this on to future generations. I'm hoping that people look at this documentary and it's, it's almost like a catalyst for the change that needs to take place in our educational system. Uh, when I look at the educational system as it is today and I ask myself, what's missing? Like, where are we missing that? The difference was in Reigns High School was the expectation of the staff and the teachers and the principals. The bar was raised by the principal. It was set so high that even the people that failed to meet it were so superior to the rest of the students that uh, it just, they were destined for success. Um, a prime example would be the way they carried themselves. Um, I went to high school and you know, it was high school. We wore jeans, we wore a t-shirt, but at Reigns High School, there was so much pride uh, in the students that they would come to school with three-piece suits on and, and briefcase because they were taught that they were number one and that they could never fail and they never say die. And, and so I think the, the, uh, the attitude and the mindset of the staff and the principals, um, they raised the bar so high that the expectation was there and the students didn't want to disappoint them. We Remember Reigns seeks to give to the community uh, that, that spark to know that even in our new educational climate that we have, that education can work 
and it will work when we are committed to the students. No matter their background, no matter the circumstances, they can rise if given the opportunity.